Suck it, lock it, polka dot it, countrify it, hip hop it. Put your hawk in the sky, move side to side. Jump to the left, stick it, and glide. Hello and welcome back to another video. Whoa, whoa, whoa. This is Nelly Yelly 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 V Yee Yee Yell. And we are not going to maintain that same amount of energy throughout the whole video. <laughs> if this is your first time here, go ahead and like. You know, like follow and like leave a comment. Go ahead and like the video. Like, like I know we just started, but like you might as well just go ahead and get it out of the way. You know what I mean? <laughs> let's call that an intro and like let's just get on into what we are doing here today. First, let me ask who, who's a podcast fan? Podcast fans, you, you, you in the back, you over there, yes, okay. Most of us these days have at least one or two podcasts that we listen to weekly, you know, if not daily. Um, I also have a podcast and season two is coming out soon, so like go ahead and find that on your platform of choice uh, and follow, turn on post notifications so you are ready for, you know what I'm saying? You don't want to miss season two of the podcast because I'm coming with the juice. And if you haven't heard season one, go ahead and do that. Okay, I'm done with my shameless plug. Let's move right on. Okay. So if you've seen the title, you already know what this is. This is going to be sliding down. Six hours later. So if you've already seen the title, like you, 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 you know what we're doing here. You know how to read. You, you're using your context clues. I'm talking about podcasts. You read the title. You saw a thumbnail. So one of the podcasts that I've been listening to recently that I've added to my list is the Put a Sock in It podcast. Put a sock in it podcast. Also, if you want to find my podcast, the link is down below. It's Nellyville the podcast. Like you're gonna, you'll, you'll love it. So go listen to it and tell me how you did. Anyways, Put a Sock in It podcast with. Lorraine and Noah Beck. Lorraine, Noah Beck, TikTokers, YouTubers, influencers, you know, that kind of gig. Very, very sweet, lovely boys, you, you know. If you're looking for a podcast that is very chill, yet comical, but you yet you get a little bit of tea, maybe a little bit of advice, this is this is going to be the show for you. Check it out. Check it out. Um, if, if you, you know, if you just kind of want something that is, you know, not all... It, it's, um, how, how can I say, if, you, if you're just looking for something that's a little more tame, then yeah, head on over. I, I recommend. Now, I have questions, and maybe you guys can help me figure it out. If I have any lawyers, if I have anyone who is familiar with uh, suing <laughs> works, um, maybe you can help me answer some of these questions that I have. Okay, so I've been listening to this podcast. This is perfume, not a, not, it's not, it's not a real microphone, guys. Like, come on. Like, it's clearly a perfume, right? Like, see, like. <laughs> One hour later. Okay, it smells good, though. I've been listening to LeRae and Noah Beck and their Put a Sock in It podcast. And, and I lo love so much. But, um, there's a segment that they have that kind of has me raising two, three, four eyebrows. Um, there's a little segment that they do at the end where they uh, pre-record uh, their their viewers who call in. So they'll, they'll post a little question on like their little Instagrams or their Twitters and their fans will call a little hotline and they will share a story. They will ask some questions and these things, right? Um, if you are not familiar with these two young men, they, they are very young men. Therefore, they have very young fans. Now, you have some older fans like me. You have the more mature fans like myself. But let's be honest. We got a lot of young, you know what I'm saying? So what I'm getting at here is, so with this segment, a lot of times, um, I, I would say it's about 50-50 split. But more uh, than is probably comfortable. I know I'm not getting right to it. I'm trying to. I'm trying to get there. Um, so <sighs> these young people who and it's not like oh like little 22 year old young no like clearly like children. Okay, are 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 calling in and saying things that are very illegal. Now these calls for the most part are anonymous. And so, you know, hey, no face, no case, you know what I'm saying? But 
I I just um is are people and, and maybe there's something going on behind the scenes where there's paperwork being filled out or there's waivers or there's approval of some of the legal sort that is protecting not only the podcast but these young men Lorraine and Noah and I just wonder y'all get what I'm saying like how is it allowed that you can have minors talking about very not minor things um I, I, to me I feel like because he I'm sure there's going to be some parents who are going to be listening. There's some responsible parents who are going to be monitoring and making sure that their kids aren't aren't doing anything crazy or listening to anything way totally inappropriate. And they're going to get on top of it. All right. Um, so for those parents who, who you're going to recognize your kid's voice, right? Mostly. Um, so like, what if a parent gets mad and I'm like, how dare you air that conversation? Like, I'm not going, use your imagination. I'm not going to repeat the things that these minors say. And it's not always minors. I was, I would say it's at least half and half. Most of the time it is people you can tell that they are of age, be it either they say their age or you, you hear it in their voice. Now, not to say that some of these kids don't sound like they uh, are older than myself, but you know, uh, but some of these people, um, I, and I'm concerned. Um, I would hate for the young Lorraine or Noah Beck to be tarnished and have to deal with the lawsuits and have to deal with the ramifications for airing the dirty laundry of the minors on the podcast uh, for laughs and giggles. It just seems like, um, you know, it might even just come off as tacky or in bad taste. It may be a turn off, may make may make you lose some sponsors there. Um what do y'all think? Am I reading too much into it? If am I is this just the adult in me jumping out? Is it is it the 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 the, the mothering? I don't have children, but is it the mothering jumping out? Y'all get what I mean? Because I, I do want it to be a success. Although I will say I'm not really sure um, how well the Lorraine Noah Beck collab is going to work. Um, I, I, I definitely get it. From a PR standpoint, I, I, I see why they got put together. But in the long run, they seem so different. And of course, you want a yin and a yang if you're going to have a multi-person uh, podcast. Obviously, you want very vastly different opinions or personalities to come together because it that makes a really great dynamic and makes for good content. But um, there's a line because then you go too different and then it's uh, the, it, it can't evolve, it can't grow. Now, the, the podcast is still very young. Uh, it's new. People got to get into a groove. So, so far, so good. Um, uh, I hope for the best. But, it, but you know what? Look, I just don't want this. I don't want to see this ship sink over a phone call. <laughs> you know? Um, so, yeah, that's all I have to say. So, don't forget about my podcast, which is Link. Down, be down below. Nellyville the podcast. Season two. So, um, so, yeah, that's all that I have for you guys today. Please uh, uh, leave me a little comment. Leave me a little like. Subscribe. Come back. So glad to see you. You look great. I hope all is well. Um, uh, um, come say hello on all my other social media. And um, I keep looking. Y'all know by now. I'm looking in the monitor. I... I Do we have to keep going over it every week? We know. I'm narcissistic and conceited and very stuck on myself. I'm going to keep looking. <laughs> she said sweetly. <laughs> Anyways, um, yeah, so you have a great day. And I'll see you little uh, podcasters. <laughs> I'll see you little audio sound waves. <laughs> Later. Um, 
I'm gonna go have a moment with myself. Bye, thank you so much.